Hi, it's Chase here and Kyle. Kyle, uh, I'm on the draw. draw. He, I'm on the play. Yep. Seven. I will keep. I will keep my eyes open. Um, I'm going to. Well, no, it's, you have the black interior for the Doesn't matter what order oh, I play so it in, so I'm going to play a island go. Okay, sure. Let's go. Draw. I'm going to play a Salt Falls untap due to island. Yep. I'm going to pay two. I'm going to play a Mercurial Spell Dancer. Let's go ahead. Keep your hot. Two counters to copy you. Okay. After doing combat damage. Okay. So yeah, if I attack you, it has two oil cards on it, and I hit you in the face, I can spend the two to then double the next instant force, or copy the next instant force. Okay. 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 Yeah. Yep. I pass. Right. Draw. I'm going to go ahead and play a Monumental Facade as land for turn. It ETBs with two oil counters on it. I may tap it and move an oil counter to a creature or artifact I control as a sorcery. Okay. Uh, we will go ahead and pay a red and cast a Vindictive Flame Stoker. Stroker. Okay. And I'll go to combat and I'll hit you for two. Okay. And I will cast turn. It's not creature spells. Okay. Yep, not creature spells. So I'm casting nine creature spells. Sure. Shopping card! <laughs> Yeah, yeah. 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 Cast trigger. I cast a non-creature spell. They'll both get a counter on them. We'll then look at the top three. We're going to go ahead and put this guy right here in the hand and put two on the bottom in any order. I will then proliferate to What's two, up, two, and three. All right. And uh, now I'll go to untap. Yep. Untap. Draw. We will go with a monumental facade as a lamp return. Okay. Uh, there's two oil counters there. Um, I am then going to go ahead and tap three. I'm going to play an Urbrask's Forge. Alright. Um. Okay. okay. So, trigger, I cast a non creature spell, counter and counter. Uh, I will pay, well, pay. I'm going to tap this as a sorcery okay. to move an oil counter onto my forge. Okay. Uh, I will go to combat, uh, trigger on my forge. Yep. It'll go to two. I will create a two two. Oh, sorry, two, two one, one. haste trampler. Okay. Uh, and we will go to combat, and I will swing my two one unblockable and my two two haste trampler. Okay. <laughs> okay, no bucks. Alright, uh, you'll take four. This two is four. Uh, Fourteen. Uh, and this dies at the end of turn, so pass turn. Okay. Um, sure. <laughs> <laughs> Restoration. I just get to yeah. search for planes right now. 
<coughs> planes. Yep. Off of casting that, I'm going to get a spirit. Yep. Spirit. That's a 1-1 one, one moment. Correct? Uh, yep. It's yep. equal to... Yep, number spirits. spirits. Yep. Yep. Cool. Cool. Play the land. One, I'll cast Spirited Companion, I get to draw a card. Yeah. Draw. It's a 1-2? Yeah. Okay, so this gives other enchantments creatures plus 1, plus 1. So I'll swing with my 3-3 three, three with lifelink. Uh, I will take the ring. Okay. I will go to 17. I pass. These spirits do not have flying. Untap. Draw for turn. Solve for false for turn. You're at 17. <laughs> What are you threatening on the crack back currently? They're not enchantments, correct? They are not enchantments, so the plus one only goes to so these three. So you're looking at three. Oh, sorry, it does include itself, so it's only these two. So we're looking at three, four, five, six, seven. On board, we're looking at 16 power. Uh, and as long as you control seven or more enchantments, they will get flying and vigilant. Yep, all my creatures. And you're at five? One, two, th one, two, three, four, five. Yes. yes. So you can probably hit that next turn. So I think my plan is this. We start tapping two okay. for a contentious plan. Uh, so first thing, uh, non-creature spell. I will then proliferate. Yep. Yep. Three, and then I will draw a card. Okay. I'll then pay two. To potential plan again. Okay. So, proliferate, the proliferate, and the proliferate. And then these are cast and proliferates. Yes. So, actually, I'm just going to go ahead and put these into seven. And Seven. Okay. Uh, I will move one from here to here. Oh, I'm drawing a card, sorry. Okay. Drew that, okay. Um, and I will go to combat. This goes up to six. So I have a six one haste trample. Uh, and a two one unblockable. I'll swing with both of those. Okay. Um, two here and... Unblockable. Oh, it's unblockable, yep. Um, then I'll just do the two nice. there. All right, so they'll trade. Yep. Um, and then you'll take two. Yep. And 15. I'll pass turn. Okay. Yeah, I, yep. I'm tapped out, so I'm not going to use the two. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, I didn't even think about that. Um, okay. Look, I did think about it, but the proliferates pre combat to make Urbrass bigger was pretty, pretty yeah. good. Draw, trigger. Um, I will discard ossification and then bring it back tapped um, this one's kind of weird so I can bring it back tapped I'm gonna attach it to my forest okay and then I'm gonna target 
this creature. The spell dancer, so it's exile until yep. it, so it's O-ring. And okay. then before that resolves, I'm going to tap before the same forest I'm going to attach it to and use this to copy it so that I target both of your creatures. So this says I can uh, copy a target triggered ability. Uh, I control from an enchantment source, and so this is an enchantment source. So I can yep. copy no, no. it, yeah. and then... Okay. Yep. Yep. So they're, so they're both, both O-ringed under that. Yep. Keep this over here. So this is tapped. Um, it seems like the right right I mean, this is technically tapped, but it doesn't matter. Um, hopefully there's not a board right. Sorry. One, two, three, four, five. No. One. Two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. One, two, cast naturalist. Mm -hmm. Now I have seven guys. I'm gonna put these back here because I have some room sickness. Yep. And then tap for one white. Play this, targeting this. Um, it gets plus one, plus one for each artifact and creature. And no, nope, artifact or enchantment I control until end of turn. Okay. So to get plus one, two, three, four, five, six, four, five, six, seven, eight. So he's just gonna get plus eight, plus eight. Combat. Total damage? I will calculate it. So 8 plus 2 is 10, plus another 1 is 11. 11 plus 2 is 13. 13 plus 3 is 16. <laughs> Matt one. Uh, and then I gain 11. Yeah. All right. So, yep. You have anything else on your turn? Nope. Okay. Untap. Draw. I got it. Okay. Uh, had you not removed my creatures, you were dead. Yeah, I 100% I knew it. I knew if I couldn't get rid of the... Uh... Uh, the biggest thing that saved you was the fact that it took me so long to hit a third blue mana. Yeah. I, I wouldn't... I think I'm stuck where I don't know what spells that you would necessarily copy. Yeah. Brandon. 20 oil counters on board and I died. Uh, <laughs> um, Sorry. 26 oil counters on board. Um, I had 7 on both creatures, 6 on my forge, and then 3 on each land. He, he O-ringed both my creatures simultaneously. Um, and then hit me for 11 lifelink. If I could stop playing green white today, it'd be great. Life gain is such a pain in the butt. Yeah. All right, I'll actually look at the sideboard I have.
Oh, perfect. I did not have anything on sideboard before today, and my brother brought me some cards that he had because I he is, nice. he has some of my cards that I need at his house, um, and I didn't actually read this card, and I realized it can't doesn't have to just target my stuff, and that's great. Nothing quite like going to combat and telling your opponent they can't attack. <laughs> or at least not with the creatures they want to. Huh. Yeah, I have no idea what that card is. Well, whether or not I get to play it, it will be up to, up to luck. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be on the play. Okay, sounds good. Come on. Stay in the deck. I hate these things so much. Legit. Gotta do it. Gotta do it. Yeah. Oh, sorry, one sec. No problem? I just realized one of the cards I put in is gonna hurt me a lot more than they would ever hurt you. Understandable. <laughs> Yeah, at first I was like treating my sideboard like I was playing against Phoenix because you know it's red mm. blue, but like yeah, no, it's a little bit of a different deck. Yeah. Yeah, I used to run Phoenix before I started running this deck. I was trying to run this deck because like um, feels like it's not like just like a copy of mm -hmm. another deck, and like I have more control over it. And, yeah. I made a lands deck that I wanted to do, but it's still in construction. And the biggest issue was that I saw the spoilers for Mom yeah. and Ren and Realm Breaker. It, Ren and Realm Breaker from the Mom set, it will completely change how that deck works fundamentally. So I'm like, I, I'm not even going to put any time until that's out. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, which I guess is next week. Yeah, I can't wait. Yeah, I'll be here. Uh, I may or may not. We'll see where I'm at. Uh, you know what? I'm going to do the thing and I'm going to move. Okay. I will keep. Yeah, Life King is hard to play against. It's also hard to play against my deck once I start getting those tokens out and there's no board wipe. Yeah, red-blue kind of lacks a board wipe. Yeah. yeah that's it also lacks felt. enchantment removal. That's the good part for me. Yeah, I, I like that blue-red doesn't really have enchantment removal, and then also black-red also t doesn't tend to run enchantment removal. I mean, you can bounce stuff, but yeah. even then, it's I'll just so play it. Great. It, you tempoed a buff. Yeah. Great job tempoing an anthem. Silly. Silly, 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 silly. We'll keep it. Uh, Steam Ben's taking two. Yep. Tap it. Scamp, hit you for one. Okay. Yeah, I meant the pass turn. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, all my creatures gain oil counters the same exact way. Okay. Uh, true. Pass. <coughs> Untap, draw. Uh, combat, swing one. 18? Uh, I would normally do this on your end step, but I need land drop, so opt. Okay. Yeah, I know how that feels. Uh, scry one. Draw one. Pass turn. 
Combat and swing one. Damage. Or no blocks. No blocks. Okay. Just take one. Uh, second main phase. I'm gonna cast a vindictive fight stroker. Uh, okay, that's the same still. guy from last yep. game. Okay. Yep. Faster. Okay. Yeah, he gains oil counters the same way. He pings you for one damage with an oil counter. He can use up to six to reduce his mana cost and a second ability, so I can just discard my hand and draw four cards. Okay. Um, Which will never happen if I don't hit a mana. Yeah, it should be. Besage you. Classification targeting that guy, attaching it to my friends. Yep. Combat, swing for one. Take one. Wow, this is like. Um, I pass. It's like you're me. Pass turn. Okay. They can only do damage to me, right? With the yep, tap. to each opponent. Okay. Technically, it's not just you, it's every opponent. Okay. One is your card. Um, take three to cast Hallowed Haunting. Yep. Tap land. That thing is no longer in existence. Combat, swing with both these guys. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to ping you for one, and my response also is going to be an experimental augury. Okay. So, just for his oil counters, in the end, he's going to be at two. Okay. He's going to gain one from the cast, and, and this is going to proliferate. Yep. I'm going to look at three and put one in my hand, one, or two at the bottom. Okay. Uh, and I'll take three, and go down to 14. Okay, and then I gain two. Yep. Um, I pass. Uh, land for turn. Forge for turn. Okay. Uh, go to combat. Gets a counter. I get a 1-1. One, one, or, yeah, 1-1. One, one. Yep. I will swing at you for 2. Damage. Yep. 2. Right, yes. Yep. Okay. Two one ones, and then end step sacrificed. Okay. Pass turn. Drop. Restoration. Is that seven? That is three. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six. I didn't know you were counting enchantments. Okay. I thought you were counting power. No, but yeah, I, you have two Hallowed Hauntings, so I'm yep. counting your enchantments. So, uh, wait, three damage, right? Yep, right. three. And, then and you gain two? Gain two. And I pass. All right. Draw. Land for turn. Play tap mountain, play scan. Okay. Tap two, experimental augury. Okay. Triggers. 
cast, proliferate, cast, proliferate, and just proliferate. Look at the top three for one hand. That hand at the bottom. One Stoker. I'm using it no matter what. I just need to know how much damage. I think I did technically miss a trigger when he got cast, but that's fine. You can. It's I don't I don't remember, and I'm just gonna leave it. It's not gonna. That one oil counter is not gonna be the make or break. Um, go to combat. Okay. This goes to three. So. Yep. Three three or three one. Trample haste. He's not haste. He is haste. You have two twos. Yep. Swinging with a three one. Trample. No blocks. Okay. Uh, take three. Eighteen down to fifteen. Yep. And that's her. Okay. Draw. Um. I will discard. This card is doing this. Enchantment. I'll attach it to this planes and then target this. Yep. Classification. Um, o ranked. It's gone. Can't do with it. It's gone with the game. Never play with it again. Oblivion ring. It's exiled until that land's destroyed or the enchantment's gone, and I can't do either. Uh, Wedding announcement. Now I should have seven. Yes. No, yep. that was or seven. Eight. Yeah. Yep. So that would be eight. I get another two spirits. So um, two that have summoning sickness and two that don't. And then we'll cast another wedding announcement and make this go to four. What can I do against green white? Turn, we're turn like five, and he's looking at his board. Combat. Good game. Good game. I just, I have Silex in hand. I'm threatening lethal, and then he gains life every, two life every turn, and I can't do anything. Um, Anger of the Gods. What's that do? It's my the board wipe I ran when I played um, red, blue. It's uh, three damage to each creature and can exile them. Um, oh, one that's better than that is the Brotherhood's End. Uh, it's actually what I was thinking What's right away. Do? It's three damage for only three, but I don't have any. What's it? Is it three, three damage for a creature. creature, each creature? So you get to choose between two options. Yeah, so the thing that sucks is it hits your own creatures, yeah, so and that's, that's why... That's that's the thing, is I can't run board wipes if I, I hang my own creatures. <laughs> I think you need autolith. I think you need to... Yeah, no, I don't doubt yeah. that, but I'm not paying 20 bucks for a I'm sorry, that card needs to be reprinted. 